We have a robot that you can put in the airplane without any modification, and then you'll be able to fly the airplane just like a human pilots do. My original motivation was to send the pilot robot into the danger zone. Suppose there's a nuclear accident, you need to catch fire, wildfire, where the airplane can be damaged really. Every time we train a new pilot, it costs a lot of money and there's a lot of uh, the risk factors. And also any experience that one pilot has cannot be easily transferred to the next pilot. But this is a robot, you can create a lot, a lot of them. Once you have a one program, you can simply copy and paste the other robots. So when they make a UAV, they design their plane from ground up. Well, if you need a special airplane, then you need to do that. But um, for if you want some casual unmanned application, why don't you use the existing airplane by simply throwing in one robot that acts like a human pilot? This robot's work, it, it, it touches every aspect of robotics. So even if we start with the, the manipulation, recognition, the planning, and how to teach the intelligence. There are a lot, a lot of problems, but the, what you're doing is we are barely scratching the surface right now, and the, we are identifying the research topics, and then we are trying to do something we do best. We like to show the world that it may be possible.